Hey everyone, welcome back to Beam Design Studio, building smarter, designing better. Today, we are diving into the brand new features of Autodesk Navisworks 2026. The industry's favorite tool just got a major upgrade. Whether you are a Beam coordinator, Beam manager, or just exploring Navisworks for the first time, this update has something for everyone. So stay tuned as we break down the enhancements that will take your coordination and class detection workflows to the next level. Navisworks Manage 2026 introduces enhancements to Glass Detective including a revamped appearance profiler and improvements to the major panel. Additionally, new features like property sets, a new NWD export function, and a lockable pivot point for navigation have been added. The software also boasts a redesigned user interface with updated dialog boxes, forms, and icons. 1. User Interface and Usability Improvements the Navisworks user interface has been refreshed with updated dialog boxes and icon appearances. For example, the saved viewpoints, properties, sets, and fine items windows all have a more modern appearance and improvements such as search. There are also several general improvements including updated color pickers, improved behavior when docking windows, and related dialogs being combined. 2. Class Detective Improvements the class detective now has improved filtering and sorting functionality on the tests panel and results tab. Depending on the contents of the selected column, you can filter using text, number, and date options. Other improvements include improved consistency of icons and refreshed user interface throughout, new set default assignee option on the tests panel, new last round column in tests panel, result and result by columns now available on the results tab. Assign a priority to class tests and class results using the new priority columns on the tests panel and results tab. Class result priority can also be included in reports. Test type is now included as an individual column in the results tab and the description column is editable. A new delete empty groups button on the results tab enables you to delete all empty class groups. The results tab now includes a column containing the number of classes in a group. Group classes based on class property data using functionality previously only available in the Navisworks coordination issues add-in. Class and issue statuses are now synchronized when creating issues from classes using the Navisworks coordination issues add-in. 3. Appearance Profiler The Appearance Profiler has undergone a redesign and had new options added to improved usability. Enhancements include a new profiles area containing icons to represent the dialog options, the ability to import profiles, an easier to use by property tab that includes pre-populated properties. An option to test the selection for each profile rule after adding them to the profile. Saving appearance profiles as XML files instead of DAT files. The ability to hide all objects not found in the profile. 4. Major Panel The Major Tools window has been redesigned to use a simpler and more modern user interface. It also now includes a Save Measurement option which enables you to save the current measurement to the Save Measurements dialog box. On this dialog box, you can rename your saved measurements, delete sets of saved measurements, and export them. 5. Pivot Point Lock When using Navigation Bar or Steering Wheels tools to navigate around a model, the pivot point is the point in the scene around which the navigation occurs. The pivot point can now be locked in position to aid with precise navigation. The pivot point option can be found in the Navisworks status bar. It indicates whether the pivot point is currently locked or unlocked and can be toggled to turn the lock on and off. 6. Export to NWD You can now configure and export NWD files out of Navisworks using the NWD option within the Export Scene panel in the Output tab. The available configuration options are Exclude hidden items that removes hidden objects from the NWD on export Embed recap and texture data that embeds externally referenced files including textures and recap files into the NWD on export. Prevent object property export that excludes object properties that come from native CAD packages in the exported file. Navisworks version that specifies the file format version that you want to save the NWD file as. 7. Property sets. You can now easily filter for and create custom sets of properties using the property sets option within the display panel of the home tab. Create property sets by searching for properties or navigating the property tree in the create property set dialog box. Created property sets are available in the properties window. The new quick properties drop down list on the display tab and also in the selection inspector window enabling export as a CSV. 8. Default file format. 
With the release of Navisor 2026, the new 2026 file format is available when saving YunWD and YunWF files. You can use the default format version option on the YunWD page within the model node of the options editor dialog box to select which file format version you want to save YunWD and YunWF files as by default. There is also a new indicator on the status bar that displays the format version of the current file. That's a wrap on the new features in Autodesk Navisworks 2026. Exciting times ahead for the BIM work. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss an update from BIM Design Studio. Drop a comment below if you have any questions or want to see a deep dive into any specific features. I'd love to hear from you. Until next time, keep building smarter and designing better.